Okay, today I'm going to show you how to add windows and transfer the pattern of your Beacon Hill dollhouse to your addition. Here's our front porch and then off of it I've created a door that will be part of our addition. You will notice that we have a set of three bay windows here. Okay, that is actually what comes with the addition or the actual dollhouse rather. And what you're going to do is you're going to take your board that you have. If you have store bought from like the craft store, they're pretty um, nice sanded boards already. Um, so you could use those or you could go to the hardware store and you can buy yourself a sheet of Luan and then cut that. That's a little bit thicker than the dollhouse board. This is actually the craft board which is pretty nice and sturdy and over here I'm going to take the board I'm going to put it on the floor which will be the table and I'm going to trace my pattern before I put this base down from the inside so I can have the exact windows that will allow me to use the frames that came with this and once you have it traced you're going to score the top of it out the line where you have it with your Dremel Max Multi Max tool. Make sure you have the flat edge blade on it to use it. Now, if you happen to trace your windows in the wrong direction, make sure you haven't cut them first. It's no big deal because you can put wallpaper on it or you can lightly sand the pencil mark off. Okay, and I'll show you how to cut it. Alright, so I have my Dremel Multi Max tool. I'm going to turn it on. I have the power set at 2. the rest of the way all the way around and then when you're done you'll have your second window cut out but to start your first window always make sure that you just lightly score the top all the way around just like that that's going to keep it from chipping and um, breaking up on you Give it a light score and then finish cutting out the rest of it. Okay, so there's two windows cut out. I'll work on the third and then we'll be right back. Okay, so I have all three windows cut out for the addition. As you notice, they're just like the ones that's there. Now what's going to happen is this addition is going to actually go on the side going to butt right up into the corner here and then those windows are going to go off the front and don't worry about it they're not perfectly straight because you can sand them down and or you can take a little razor knife to it and if you happen to get splinters like that that's okay just sand it because your molding of your window will cover it it's not a big deal okay and again make sure you transfer the window pattern exactly as you want it and trace it exactly as it is or your windows will not fit properly. All right, well, check back. Follow me on my Facebook page under um, Miniature Madness, or Miniature Dollhouse Madness, rather, and check out more pictures, and I'll let you know how this works out. Talk to you later. Bye.